Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joe and welcome to a brand new video. This is going to be a short video. I've got another video coming out later today, but I just kind of wanted to talk about this. So if you launch your Team Fortress 2 right now, keep in mind it's the 1st of October. There's not been an update to the game. Uh, as far as I'm aware anyway, there's not been an update to the game. No new content has been added, but if you launch your game, you get the stock Halloween loading screen. And if you go onto matchmaking, you click casual, Halloween is there. And I, I don't know, apparently yesterday on the 30th of September, if you changed your PC's time and date to the 1st of October, then this would be enabled. So assuming this is all up and working correctly, if you tick all the Halloween maps and queue into a game, it will put you into a Scream Fortress game mode. So I'm going to do exactly that. So, I'm in a Halloween game mode. Halloween servers are officially up, and a lot of people are confused about this. Initially, I was super confused about this, because, I mean, last Scream Fortress was on the 19th of October, and I don't remember the Scream Fortress servers opening up early. However, apparently this is a thing. Apparently, Valve have set an automatic schedule for respective holidays. So, at the start of October for Scream Fortress, and the start of December for Smithsmas, uh, it enables the servers for those modes. Modes, but I didn't realize this was a thing and I don't think a lot of people did now This is just what a few people on things like reddit and YouTube comments have been saying However, my guess is this was completely accident and the Halloween servers were let out prematurely I don't know if anyone remembers but a couple days ago the steam servers were all over the place Like all the steam servers were down Maybe that played a part in accidentally prematurely releasing a, a queued update so to speak now, does this impact the future of the Scream Fortress updates? Because I initially, when I saw this, assumed that this meant this was all we were getting. We were getting no crates, no cosmetics, nothing like that. It was just going to be enabling old Halloween maps. And apparently, that's not the case. The enabling of the Scream Fortress servers has no real correlation to the actual content that gets added to the game. So, around the middle towards the end of October, hopefully we can still expect to see Halloween content added into the game. I hope this cleared some stuff up for you guys, because I know there is a lot of misconceptions right now. Of course, though, this is just all be me being optimistic. I mean, for all I know, they could have just enabled Halloween maps like three weeks earlier than the updates normally are and been done with it. And that's quite a sad thought to think that they could do that but it is a possibility and hopefully we have some great content to look forward to thanks for watching guys and peace not writing sonnets keep it close to my heart like a locket never dishonest high up in the stars just like a comet i get that profit then i do the dash just like i'm sonic i'm dancing out the blue so they can call me super sonic but my eyes been super red because we've been smoking super chronic got the flavors in the bag you would think that i'm a florist and i know that makes you mad